We're always interested in seeing people's garages and their workshops and uh, seeing how people get things done. And it's always fascinating to me to see somebody who can build a, a really cool hot rod or restore a motorcycle or, or build something cool in their garage, especially when it's a very small, you know, like a single car garage. And I've learned that the secret to making this happen is good organization and storage of all the stuff so that you don't open the doors and just have chaos. And uh, we recently were at uh, Pit Pal Products. Their customers are unaware that the same products they may be using in the trailer are just as effective in their garage and can kind of free you up to fit a lot of stuff in a small space and allow you to get some work done. In this example, they set up a 70 square foot space, which isn't very big, but by using some of the uh, organization products they make, they were able to mount 43 different products in that 70 square foot space and still have 65 square feet of floor space. I know at PitPal Products, not only do we take pride in what we make, but we also take pride in thinking the best way to actually store stuff to make your job a little easier. So the mission here is to get everything up off the floor and use the walls a lot and then use smart solutions to store everything so that everything's got its place and you got plenty of room left to work. I think the focus of any working garage space is the work surface itself. And uh, PitPal has a bunch of different options. In this case, they've got a really nice workbench uh, in the corner. Some of the things that are sort of unique are, like here's this little latex glove holder. It's a great place to be able to put above a workbench, but yet know where your gloves are at. Tape measures. I always think that it's hard to find a tape measure in a garage or a shop, so we made a little bracket for it. You'll also notice a couple other neat little brackets to hold things that are commonly littering up your bench space. Uh, pens, markers, and notepads all fit in another aluminum bracket that you can get from PitPal. Uh, they also have this neat segmented rack for zip ties and tie wraps. You know, these things come in a plastic bag in different sizes. You're digging around for them. Now you can mount them cleanly where you can see at a glance where they're at. One of PitPal's more famous items is the wall organizer. We've made this thing for almost three decades. How can a shop, garage, or even a trailer be without this? It's a place to put your aerosol, your pump bottles, oil. I love the fact that it's got a fold down tray and then it conceals everything. Plus we got that spring loaded paper towel to actually put tension on it as we pale it back. Again, these come in different shapes and sizes, but you can adapt that to your garage or your workspace. So now you've got instant access and it folds up out of the way when you're not using it. I find that certain things tend to walk out of the shop, uh, one of them being a flashlight. You can never find the flashlight, but I think if you've got a permanent home for something, it'll stay there. PitPal makes this cool little aluminum mag light flashlight bracket. If you put one of these up, first of all, you know where the flashlight is, but second of all, if the flashlight's missing, you know it. So it's always good to be able to keep tabs on it. Being organized and efficient is not just about uncluttering your space, but also making it quicker to get to the stuff you need. Uh, PitPal came up with this vertical storage rack for aerosol cans, and you can put paints or detail products or lubricants, you know, anything that comes in an aerosol. But the nice thing is, you can see at a glance where everything is. You don't have to open a cabinet, reach in and dig around and, you know, turn every single can of paint around to find the one you want. PitPal manufactures at least 15 products in both horizontal and vertical format to store aerosol cans in just about any available space. Do you have a current and charged fire extinguisher in your shop? You don't want to spend all this money building a car or have a nice house and have the whole thing go up in smoke. Now there's no reason not to have one handy. PitPal's got a cool bracket for that too. That's what PitPal specializes in. Our slogan is to get organized and that's exactly what we do. We'll get you organized. I look at every square foot of our shop as something that you're either paying rent on or paying the mortgage. So each square foot is valuable, and you hate to see things like garbage cans take good valuable space. Well, the guys at PitPal came up with kind of a neat solution. It's actually a bracket that holds a bag. So you don't have to have a garbage can standing there all the time, tripping over, walking around it, you know, trying to find a place to put it. And then when you're done, you throw the bag away, you put the bracket away, and you don't have to worry about tripping over a garbage can. It's pretty simple. This next idea really came straight from the race trailers. When you look inside a race team trailer, you see tires hanging up near the ceiling, and it's a great way to store things out of the way, so they came up with this tire rack system. But the idea of our system it is the telescopes, the way we developed it, so it can virtually fit any wheel or tire and wheel combination. Certain things are just hard to store because they're a weird shape. Um, take a look at this buffer holder. 
Uh, if you spend time polishing cars, doing detail work, you've got a buffer. And they don't fit in a toolbox very well. And they've got a core and they're kind of gangly. So PitPal came up with this device that holds a buffer properly. It'll keep dust off the pads and uh, keeps them out of the way. They've got a similar product. It's a tape gun holder. Again, a tape gun is a weird shaped thing, but more and more people are buying and selling things on eBay and shipping stuff. So tape guns are becoming pretty popular in the garage. This is a great way to keep it out of the way. There are certain tools that kind of go together. Uh, you'll never use an air chuck unless you have an air hose to connect it to. So they came up with a bracket that not only keeps your air hose tidy and out of the way, but it's got a cool little slot so you can put your tire pressure gauge and your air chuck in the same spot and therefore you just look and see it's all together and you won't lose it. We showed you the wall cabinet that had the flip down door. They also have a series of universal cabinets that just has rows of shelves and these come in a variety of different sizes, widths, heights and depths of shelves to hold different things. Everything from oils and lubricants to uh, detail products, paper towels, you know, whatever you got. You can stick these from floor to ceiling or on the back side of doors and really get all that stuff off your workbench and hanging on the wall. Buckets are one of those things that are kind of hard to store. Uh, you can put things in them, but then you got a bucket on the floor, you're tripping over it and all that stuff. Again, using up available floor space in a small shop. Uh, these guys came up with a bucket holder. It's something you can screw to the wall or to the side of a cabinet. Keeps your bucket off the ground, which makes it easier to pick up, you know, if it's got stuff in it. Another thing that Pit Pail is famous for, and an item you see at racetracks all over the place, are their aluminum folding tables. And these things are just cool. You know, a lot of times you see a folding table that's made out of plastic and it's sagging, or the old wood ones that weigh a million pounds. These guys make aluminum folding tables that are made from eighth inch aircraft aluminum. They've got supports that are welded and nested in underneath, uh, latches to keep the legs from falling out, and they're just awesome looking. They're lightweight, they're very, very strong. They come in a variety of different sizes. 25 by 42, which is our small. Our medium is 25 by 60, and our large is 31 by 72. And they claim these things will support almost 1,500 pounds. So this is definitely something you can take apart a motor, or a transmission, and at the end of the day, pick it up, fold it up, put it in the corner, it's out of the way. They're even great for tradesmen, hobbyists, and even cookouts. This is another thing that I think is pretty trick, and it comes right from the trailer industry again. This is a folding aluminum work surface table. That's all it took to flip it up. This way, if you want to be able to bring a car in, or you need some extra space along the wall, when you're done at the end of the day, you just fold it down. I think the cool thing is that the guys at Pit Pal are working on cars, they're racers, they use this stuff all the time, so that's where these ideas come from. There are hundreds of more ideas for storage and organization solutions on their website, pitpal.com, or get a catalog, just call 1-800-PIT-PALS and they'll send you one out.